so today is 15th august 2017 the 70th independence day for india so i thought why not we should cover some of the little known android apps that are made by the indians for the indians like always all the download links will be in the description of this video and with that being said let's get started Now trust me on this college is going to be the only phase of your life where you will have lots of time to explore new stuff i know because i got into this online world in my second year of engineering and that being said it is okay to bunk few classes as long as it adding a value in your life and bunk manager will help you to maintain that balance most universities in india have 75% of minutes compulsory and you can use this application to keep track of that now what makes this application different from the rest is how simple it is all you have to do is add your subjects and then if you attend the class tap on attend and if you don't then tap on bunk i personally have long passed my student life but if i can go back in the past i will totally dig this application Code Finder is a simple application that compiles all the popular codes in India like your bank IFS code, train, DTH, PIN code or even the toll free numbers of most popular stores in India. Now there is nothing revolutionary going on here. In fact, most of you might be wondering why should I use this application when I can find all this information with a quick Google search or you can even ask Google Assistant without unlocking your phone. And the only reason I recommend this application is it works in offline mode. So let's say if you don't have access to internet and god forbid but if you lose your credit card then you can simply open this application and search for all the toll free numbers or even check out the vehicle number or everything like that Now Common Cut is not like the previous application but this one is the aggregator of online website which will help you to do comparison shopping. So let's say if you want to buy a external hard drive or a shoe online and you want to track its prices among all the different websites like Flipkart, Amazon, Myntra etc. So instead of doing that manually on each application or a tab you can just copy paste its name in this application and it will do it for you. You can even log in and check out from this application. In fact this is exactly they want you to do. because since this application have no ads they make money from the commission they get from your purchases you can even add other stores like paytm ebay or yapmi etc overall if you are like me who does most of his shopping online and believes in every penny safe is every money earned then yeah give it a try Now I am one of those guys whose gym routine goes off and on and apparently I'm keeping myself motivated by buying protein powders and shoes online but whenever I'm going to gym regularly I use Healthy Five Me to track my progress and maintain my calories and the reason I use this application over other is since it is an Indian app it can track the calories of all the Indian foods like dal dosa or roti etc And another thing that I like about this application is it gives you a subtle notification to drink water randomly. This is not only good for your hydration but it even forces people like me who spend all day in a chair to move a little bit. But of course you can also set reminders for food, workout and meds etc. So that's pretty sweet. Ninety-five percent of Indians travels in railway, and if you're one of those, which I'm pretty sure you are, then I highly recommend you install Rail Yatri before your every trip. So this application will automatically detect the IRCTC SMS and will give you a heads up few hours before the train arrival. It can even tell you the platform number and coach position. And then there are always other options like real-time tracking, which works quite accurately, train between stations, platform, and all the other stuff. They also serve food now, which I have tried once, and it's pretty okay. Recently they've also introduced the new PNR prediction where they try to tell you if your waiting ticket can be confirmed or not but for that I recommend confirm ticket application and the way it works is it analyzes the previous data of each train and then predicts the future or using that kind of like how human brain works Now if you're moving to a new city might be for work or internship then the first thing that you need to do is find a roof over your head and this tool will help you with that so simply open this application search for your city and there you go it will give you the list of all the available accommodation The good thing about Nestaway is they take care of all the basic things like beds furniture appliances basically you have to move in with your suitcase 
Now I did try this service once in New Delhi and to be honest it's not that great especially when it comes to value for money you can easily find a better deal if you contact a broker or use a facebook group almost every big city has a flatter flat meet facebook group which is the best in my opinion however if you are in new city for a work or job and need a decent place to crash for a few months then nestaway makes sense unlike other options they only have 6 month lock in period and yes there is no brokerage Now if you have noticed this trend earlier when there was no internet books and newspaper were the major source of information then came the internet and blogs and online text become a major source and now when storage and bandwidth is not an issue anymore videos are the next big thing and by choose the first application to understand that in simple words it's like coursera for indians so you open this application select your courses like 11 12th grade or even cat or bank bio etc and then it shows you the syllabus in video format Now yes you can find similar videos on YouTube as well but Baiju or a similar application Merit Nation have high production quality but yeah all this production quality comes with a price so yeah Baiju is free for first 15 days and then you will have to pay for the service depending on the course and duration Now there are times when a tube light is not working in your house or there's a issue with your fan Now whenever it happens you have to find a electrician or plumber which is not an easy task but even if you are able to find them you will have to convince them to come your home and they will charge premium most of the time and this is where cheap application comes in so basically what it does is it connects the plumber electricians and all the pros with a regular user so you open this application post a job and all the pros in your area will give you a code if you like it then you can schedule a visit I personally have tried this service twice and it works quite well. The payment is online so there is a transparency and the pros that comes to your house are employed from cheap only so you can expect them to come on time and they are quite polite as well. The only issue is they charge you more than a regular electrician would do. I guess that's the price you pay for the premium service but at least it saves your time so that's a plus. In the movie Three Idiots, you might remember the guy who commits suicide for not getting a job. And well, unfortunately, there are many teens in India who goes into similar depression when they get pressure from your work, family, and God knows what. Kind of like Thirteen Reasons Why. Now, this could be avoided if there is someone who can give them a cheaper or free counseling, and that too anonymously. And this is exactly where your dost comes in. So let's say if you're feeling down or you need someone to talk, simply download this application and find an expert online. and tap on the chat icon that's it now you can discuss your problem with them instantaneously and the best part is your identity is anonymous now i didn't talk to them much because i don't have any problem and i also don't want to waste their time which they would have better spent on helping someone else but yeah if you ever feel depressed and need some counseling for work relationship or whatever reason just know that it's normal and happens with everyone and yes thanks to the good folks over your toast they will lend you an ear listen to your problem and might even guide you better Now when MG started as a platform where they shows generic alternative for popular medicines. Now I won't say generic medicines are always better than the popular ones because of the quality control issues in India. But yeah, this application since then has pivoted a lot. Instead of giving advice on medicines, they are selling medicines now. And I have to say they are doing a commendable job there, especially given that it's they are dealing with a sensitive topic like healthcare and medicines. My personal experience with this application is pretty good. I often use one MG to order my medicines, which I usually get 20% discounts so far and i never had any problem in fact i mean if you are getting a same medicines in same packaging with a decent expiry date then i think nobody should have a problem and not to forget you are getting a 20 to 25% discounts from the market price to give you an idea i did some test in a lab which cost me 4k and the same test was available on 1mg for just 1.6k after discount obviously now only if i have this information earlier i would have definitely gone with this application so yeah if someone in your family orders medicine online or if you need some lab treatment then you might introduce themselves to 1mg it's pretty cool and it's available in 270 cities in india Well this is all for now. Let me know which one was your favorite Android app in the comment section below. Also if you like this video then don't forget to share it with your fellow Indians. So that's it for now. This is Munal signing off. I will see you in the next one and yes like always thank you for watching.